हेलो एंड वेलकम एवरीवन आई एम पुशक पंडित एंड आई वेलकम यू ऑल टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल बीइंग बुकिश सो आर यू रेडी फॉर द मेंटी क्विज विच आई एम गोइंग टू प्रेजेंट टुडे आई होप दैट ईच वन ऑफ यू वाचिंग दिस मस्ट हैव कंप्लीटेड दिस चैप्टर एंड टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू टेक अ शॉर्ट एंड अ वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग क्विज ऑन पीरियोडिक टेबल पीरियोडिक प्रॉपर्टीज एंड वेरिएशन इन प्रॉपर्टीज important menti quiz okay so basically we will have 10 questions and each question will comprise of each single marks okay so before i proceed i just want to say that if you are having any trouble in this chapter i have already prepared few videos on this chapter okay and uh, this is a very important chapter which has a good weight is in your board exams but whatever its the weight is i will talk about that what are the important chapters of chemistry in the later videos but today our main motive is to give a menti quiz okay so let's start now we will basically have one question and you will have some options okay and uh, you need to pick up any one question so if there is anyone who is watching this as a casual video i would just say that kindly have a serious note that do watch this video as a practice and as some sort of revision okay don't just watch it as casual so take out your notebook and write down the options okay and then as i will share the questions i will also give you the answer and match it and do comment in the comment box that how much you have scored out of 10 okay so now let's start this menti quiz now our first question is this in period 3 the most metallic element is sodium magnesium or aluminium let me give you a 5 to 10 second so that you can answer it okay so take your time and answer what is the question I hope that you must have done the question. The correct answer of this question is sodium. Okay, so this is the answer for question number one. Now let's go to question number two. So this is the second question, and the question says the energy released when an electron is added to a neutral gaseous isolated atom to form a negatively charged ion. Your options are option number A ionization enthalpy option number B is electron affinity so take your time and answer this question so i hope that you must all have done this question and uh, what is the correct answer you have got i think this is the option number B which you have all did and this is the correct answer so question number 2 answer is electron affinity okay so these are basically the definitions which you must have learned by heart now let's go to question number 3 now question number 3 is true or false okay so ionization potential increases across a period from left to right whether this statement is true or false let me give you some time so this is an easy question and i hope that till now you have already did the question and the correct answer of this question is option number a which is true so ionization potential increases across a period from left to right now let's go to question number 4 now it is a very important question let me read it question number 4 says the energy required to remove an electron from a neutral isolated gaseous atom and convert it into a positively charged gaseous ion so what is that term is it electron affinity or ionization potential or electronegativity so take your time and answer this question so i hope that you must have did the question and the correct answer of question number 4 is ionization potential so i hope that you all know this answer that ionization potential is the energy which is required to remove the electron okay now let's go to question number 5 now the question number 5 says 
द मोस्ट इलेक्ट्रो निगेटिव एलिमेंट फ्रॉम द फॉलोइंग एलिमेंट सो आउट ऑफ दीज फोर एलिमेंट विच इज द मोस्ट इलेक्ट्रो निगेटिव एलिमेंट यू नीड टू स्टेट दैट सो टेक योर टाइम एंड आंसर दिस क्वेश्चन सो आई होप दैट ऑल ऑफ यू मस्ट हैव डन दिस क्वेश्चन एंड द करेक्ट आंसर ऑफ दिस क्वेश्चन इज क्लोरिन सो द मोस्ट इलेक्ट्रो निगेटिव एलिमेंट फ्रॉम दिस इज क्लोरिन नाउ लेट सी the next five questions and we have some criteria to solve these five question let me read that parts a to e which are just the question numbers okay so parts a to e refer to changes in the properties of elements on moving from left to right across a period so we would be moving across a period from left to right of the periodic table and for each property you need to choose the correct answer so you definitely need to keep in mind that we are moving from left to right i am just telling it now and i won't tell you in the question you need to remember it okay now let me read the question the first question is the non metallic character of the element whether it decreases or increases or it remains the same or does it depends on the period so what is the correct answer now i hope that each one you have done this question and the correct answer of this question is the non metallic character of the element increases so it increases when we move across a period now let's see the second question electronegativity so whether the electronegativity depends on the valence electron or whether it remains the same or whether it decreases or whether it increases so the correct answer of this question is option number 4 which is increases so the electronegativity increases across a period now let's see the question number c question number c is ionization potential so what happens to the ionization potential whether it goes up and down or whether it decreases increases or remains the same so the correct answer of this question is ionization potential increases when we move across a period okay so i hope that each one of you must be enjoying the session and you are giving the correct answers obviously these are few basic questions which is the uh, from periodic table and i would be bringing more such question and this is just the beginning of this chapter okay now question number 4 now the question number 4 is the atomic size now whether the atomic size decreases or it increases or remains the same or question number sorry the sol, uh, option number 4 whether it sometimes increases or sometimes decreases so which of these is correct so the atomic size decreases that is the correct answer okay so i hope that each one of you must have did this answer and selected the option number 1 so atomic size decreases when we move across a period now let's see the last question of this video the last question of this is electron affinity of the elements in group 1 to 7 so whether the electron affinity from group 1 to 7 goes up and down decreases and then increases or whether it increases or just it decreases so take your time and answer this question so the correct answer of this question is option number 3 so the electron affinity of the elements in group 1 to 7 increases so these were some of the important questions of this menti quiz and for your information let me say you that there were some question from previous year and there were some question which were the good questions so if you have scored 10 upon 10 or even 10 upon 9 then many many congratulations because you have solved good questions although they seemed easy but they were good questions okay so that's all from this video i hope the video was good and you must have knowledge something from this video okay so for my upcoming videos do subscribe this channel and if the video was helpful do share it with your friends so for till now 
थैंक यू